Do you remember Sister Burgess? Yes. She, I heard she passed. Yes. I yeah, so pray for them. Yes.
much for me. I'm going to man this jacket. She is doing better. Oh, hey, man. She is doing better. So, she's just coming along. She was trying to stay in, but she wanted to be in church set up. Yeah. yeah. So she was watching online. Pray for her. Forgive me for that, but... <laughs> Ephesians 
chapter number one and verse number one. Paul, an apostle of Jesus Christ, by the will of God, to the saints which are at Ephesus, and to the faithful in Christ Jesus. All right, so Paul, uh, he's identifying himself as the author of this uh, great epistle, and uh, he's an apostle of Jesus Christ uh, by the will of God. It's been predetermined by God's will that he would be an apostle, one that is set forth to declare the word of God. And notice he's writing to the saints, to the saints specifically at Ephesus and to the faithful in Christ Jesus. So he's writing not only to the saints that are at, at Ephesus, but he's also writing to us, the body of Christ. And uh, to be a saint uh, really means that you've been set apart. Amen. Set apart to be used by God. Uh, and, that, and that you set yourself apart to be used by God. Right. Exclusively. Amen. You give up your rights, you give up your will, you give up your desires, and you exclusively belong to God. And God exclusively belongs to you. Amen? Amen. Set apart. Thank you. And, and he says here, uh, to the faithful in Christ Jesus. And, and that terminology there that he's using uh, uh, to the faithful in Christ Jesus, he's not uh, talking about those that have faith uh, and are, are walking by faith. He's really saying uh, to the faithful in Christ Jesus, those that really have faith in what Christ has said. Amen. A lot of people say they believe. Amen. And but a true believer really believes in what is written. It really believes in what has been said. And what I mean by that is, if if God says you're blessed, then you're blessed. Am I right? If God calls you a royal priesthood, a chosen generation, a holy nation, a peculiar treasure, then that's what I am. Uh, that's what I am. If the Bible says, this is what it means by faith. If, uh, 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 if, if, if the Bible says you can do all things through Christ that strengthens you, then that's what you believe. Amen? Uh, if, 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 if the Bible says you can be uh, by the blood of the Lamb, uh, you've been washed in the blood. Uh, that, and that's what you believe. That's what he means by faith. Uh, you believe the scriptures as it is written from Genesis to Revelation concerning you. There's no, there's no in between. There's no maybe about it. Uh, it's what God has said, and that's what I believe, and I'm holding to that. I'm believing in that. Uh, I live or die by that. Amen. That's totally different from some, uh, when we're just talking about generic faith. Uh, but we're talking about those that, that believe the scriptures, believe on the word uh, as, as it is written. And, and as the word is written, that's who I am. Uh, and, and God has declared me. That's who I am. Amen? Hallelujah. That, that's who I am. That's, that's, that's what I can do. Uh, and, and, and what the Word says about God's ability, uh, uh, being faithful, I believe God can do that and more. Uh, I'm trusting in what He has said. I'm, I'm faithful to what He has said. Uh, I, I, I'm living by what he has said. Uh, and there's no, there's no doubt in my mind. Uh, there's, no, there's no question in my mind uh, about if it's written, uh, it, it's, it's, it's done, it's sealed, it's over, uh, it, it, it's finished. Amen? That's what, he's, that's what he's talking about when he says the faithful in Christ Jesus. Uh, they believe uh, on, on the scriptures, on the word, uh, and there's no, there's no, 
There's no shadow of turn. Uh, what, what, is, what is written is settled, is finished, and, and what it has declared, that's what it is. That's what it is. Amen? Thank you, Lord. I remember uh, I, was, I was working my other job, and, uh, uh, you know, they give you a loan of cost, and uh, I had got, I, I signed out the car for the day, and I returned it that evening, and the next morning, uh, uh, the lady came to me and said, well, Frank, uh, there's, there's some dents in the car, and uh, uh, some things that are going on with it. She said, well, do you know anything about that? Did you do that? I said, no, I didn't do that. She said, oh, well, let's settle it. Uh, it's over. You say you didn't do it? Uh, I believe you. And she moved on. Didn't hear nothing else about it. Uh, she, she, she believed in what I said. Uh, she believed in what I said. Uh, and took me at my word. Uh, and said it was set. Uh, that's because she, 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 she knew my background. She knew my history. She knew I was walking with God. Uh, based, based on the characteristics. Right. Amen. Right. So how much more, uh, if she's taking the word of man, if you allow me to say that, how much more ought we ought to believe in the word of God? Right. Uh, take God at his word. Right. God has said it. It's said it. I don't have to debate about it. I don't have to argue about it. I just got to trust it. Uh, and live by it. That's what we're talking about, about being faithful. Amen? Yeah. And, 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 and the reason why I'm harping on that is, is, is that I know that we sometimes have the tendency to look at and read the scriptures and say, well, does that apply to me? Is that, will God do that for me? Huh? Am, 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 I, am I included in the Holy Bunch? <laughs> huh? Am I, is, 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 that, is, is my name really written in the letter books of life? Uh, am, am, I, am I really a, a, a son of God with power? Uh, do I really have the ability to, to overcome uh, every test and every trial and every temptation that comes upon me? Uh, the Word says you do. Uh, does it. So that should be said. Uh, we should take the word as the word. Amen. Do I have the ability to, 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 to love everybody like God says uh, for me to love? Uh, do I have that ability? Uh, do you have that ability? Uh, did God say that you have that ability? Yes. <laughs> uh, you follow what I'm saying? That goes so, 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 whatever. Grace be to you 
and peace from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. Well, I, I forgot a portion. Thank you, Lord. When it says faithful in Christ Jesus, he means that, that all of these promises, all the words that God has said, it is activated once you get in Christ. Uh, all the promises that God has said are, are hanging out, lingering around. <laughs> but once you get into Christ, uh, you become a new creature, uh, and in all of those promises and all that word that God has said now applies to you. Uh, uh, it belongs to you because you're in Christ. Amen. Uh, all right, here we go. He says, uh, read verse 2 again. Grace be to you and shot. peace uh -huh. from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. So then, once you are in Christ, you got grace, which is God's favor. Amen? You got God's favor upon your life. Once you get into Christ, you got the favor of God following after you. In other words, you can show up a dollar, a day late, a dollar short, and still a blessing will still be yours. Uh, hallelujah. That, that, that nothing can stop or hinder uh, the blessings that God has for you. It's activated. Uh, the, the favor of God is upon your life. Uh, God favors you. God favors you. <laughs> uh, and then I like what he said, favor ain't bad. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Now, he said, uh, grace uh, be unto you, God's favor be unto you, and peace. That word, uh, peace, uh, uh, is referring to the absence of war. Uh, 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 when, he's, uh, uh, when, when, when he's talking about the, the, the beatitude, it says, blessed are the peacemakers, uh, for they shall be called the what? Children of God, when you become a child of God uh, 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 and reconciled to Christ, uh, God is no longer angry with you. Uh, he's no longer upset with you. Amen? Uh, you, you are no longer separated with God. You have peace with God. Uh, uh, you have peace with Him. Uh, you, uh, there's no more enmity between you and God. Uh, 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 you're not the, you're no longer when you're in, in God's in God's will. You're no longer the object of God's wrath. Uh, uh, God, God can deal with you uh, in a peaceable way. Uh, you have peace with God. Uh, and, 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 and God is on your side uh, through Jesus Christ. Uh, 
After what happened to me this morning, I, I had a lot of wrath. Ah! And I believe the Holy Spirit just told me, feel sorry for the people that do evil. Absolutely. Because my wrath is going to come down on them unmercifully when it comes time. If they don't repent, my wrath will come down on them. Well, well let, me, let me help. Let me help. Yeah. Um, what, what, what you experience, it doesn't make us angry. It makes us, it gets us upset, and yeah. we want, we want vengeance. If you allow me to say, I, I don't even want vengeance right. anymore. Right. I, I forgive them for doing what they did. All right. right. Because they're, they're obviously lost. Right. But uh, what God wants us to do is, is to forgive them. Right. And pray that they get saved. Exactly. Pray that they get delivered. Not, not pray that the wrath of no, God. No, I don't want the wrath of God on them. It's, okay. but, but if they don't repent, that's what's going to happen to them. Well, the lost, but, the lost are in trouble. <laughs> well, see that we're, we're an oxymoron. If you allow me to say, you say one thing uh, with your, with your, with your lips. I understand what you're saying too. I, 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 I just. I, like I said, I forgive them totally. Exactly. And, oh. and, and I'm I'm praying for the boss to get saved so they won't be under wrath. Amen. That's, that's where, it. That's, that's where it. we're at. So that those individuals are included. It, we got to pray for them. Yeah. Hopefully they'll see the light. Amen. So so when 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 God is, is blessing us. When he has blessed us, he has in, 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 made us partakers of his blessings. Amen? And you know, the blessings of the Lord, the Bible says, make it rich uh, and adequate salt. Amen? Amen? And, and I'm using that, normally we connect that with material. Tonight, I'm going to use it with, with spiritual things. Uh, yeah. when, when God blesses you, infers what he has uh, uh, upon you, that he's established for you before the foundation of the world, it, 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 it makes you better. Yes, it does. Right. Uh, mm -hmm. It increases you. Yes. Uh, it enlarges you. Mm -hmm. uh, it causes you to be who God has called you to be. My brother. And a lot of times, Bishop, when things happen to us, God has counted us worthy yes. to be able to receive that. Yes. Uh, he counted us worthy in knowing that if we continue to follow with him, we're going to go through it. And he's going to give us double for our trouble. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. He wants us to walk with him because he's able to take us through. <coughs> Amen? Uh, I often think about even when our loved ones die. Uh, to us, it's a great loss. But with God, he looks at it in a totally different way. Uh, they just transition to be with him. Uh, uh, if they say, they transition to be with him. Amen? Uh, and, and they're not dead with him. So everything you can 
Huh? And they, 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 they turn it over. 
Hey, hold the camera. Hey. Uh, that's it, you
Am I right? What has God told you to do? If anybody has, 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 has spent any time with God and in prayer, God has, has revealed to you through Christ Jesus your assignment. Yes. He has shown it to you. Yes. Oh, woman, oh, man.
Amen? Yeah. Uh, why are we? According to the good pleasure of his will. All right. Now, God did it according to the good pleasure of his own will. God has a will. And he did it according to his will. And his will. It's already done. Read it. To the praise of the glory of his grace, uh -huh. wherein he hath made us accepted in the beloved. Now, God has made us uh, accepted in Christ Jesus. Mm -hmm. Now, if I'm accepted in Christ Jesus, why uh, should I act like I'm not accepted? Why should I act like I'm rejected? I'm accepted in him. Huh? Mm -hmm. I, I have received him. Mm -hmm. huh? I'm part of this holy family. Yes. Huh? Mm -hmm. God is mine and I'm God's. Mm -hmm. huh? Amen. Uh, I'm trusting in him. Yes. I believe in him. Mm -hmm. huh? So why wouldn't he bless me? Why wouldn't he help me? Right. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, Give my all and all. Love him like an all in love. Mm. Huh? Yes. Am I right? Praise him like an all of praise. Yes. Believe him like an all of believe. Mm -hmm. Walk with him like an all of walk with him. Yes, huh? um, all the hindrances have been taken away in Christ. And when I face the hindrance, I just believe that God.
Amen. Amen. Now we ought to uh, be encouraged. 